the lack of snow, you've noticed the geese. That means you may have noticed or stepped in a growing problem in our parks. Well, Littleton's had enough of it, so they're working on a solution. Denver 7's Jason Grenauer went out on patrol today. The morning calm and serenity of Clement Park in Littleton <laughs> is broken. These are Canada geese. <laughs> Not a few, a lot. About six to 8,000 geese. And obviously the byproduct of geese is their byproduct. And it's everywhere and could be getting even worse come springtime. The geese have increased in number and the poop has increased in number. And my biggest beef is when I'm rollerblading and it's a little wet, I slip <laughs> on the poop. The more archaic ways, um, excuse me, uh, geese, of getting them to move. Could you kindly uh, maybe find somewhere else to do all of this? Those clearly weren't working. This is my superstar Daisy. So park officials called in the pros. We get rid of unwanted geese off of various properties throughout Denver. Uh, we got some birdies up there. Within minutes. Come on, Daisy, let's go. Birdies, 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 birdies. Daisy birdies, birdies. had cleared the shores of the lake. Border collie is the most effective tool because it does uh, mimic a, a natural predator of the goose. Don't worry, this method has the PETA and Humane Society stamp of approval. We're making the geese actually think that there's a fox out there, there's a predator out there. But what about the rest of the geese on the lake? So what we have is the, uh, the predator, and it gets out there and they do not like this. Just like that, they had all moved on. I would say this is a job well done. In Littleton, dodging the you-know-what. I'm Jason Grenauer, Denver 7.